Welcome back. Friday night live improv from New York City. And now we have an, uh, one of our favorite games. Oh, we hope it's yours too, called Open Options. It's going to be played with Mark and Steve. Now, here's the deal. Uh, we're going to, they're, they're going to be actors in a movie. They're going to make up a movie for you right here uh, in, in, on the spot. Uh, I'm going to be the director. I'm going to stop them from time to time because we have one, two, three, four, five uh, producers. And uh, I don't know if you know this about the, about the biz, but the producers love to give notes. And um, we're going to be taking them because this is a game of open options. Can we, um, can we get started with the title of the movie? I would like uh, one of our producers to please give this movie a name. Open Sesame. Open Sesame is what I heard. Fabulous movie called Open Sesame. That's what we're making. And uh, what, is, um, what is just one of the locations that uh, you will find in Open Sesame? A boat in the middle of the ocean. They are in a boat in the middle of the ocean. This is a this is a big dramatic scene, guys. Are you ready? Do you are you do you feel ready for me to start the cameras, Mark? Steve, are you good? Steve is muted. Oh, you are muted, Steve. Uh, where's the where's the boom mic? Bring in the boom mic, guy. Jeez, that guy's gonna get fired. We're all set. We're all set. Then lights, camera, and action. Jordan, you were supposed to you were supposed to get hamburger buns with sesame seeds on them. These are just plain. Oh my god. Dave, I am so sorry. I did my bad. Well, that's okay. That's okay, I guess. Well, I made Cut, cut. You guys are doing great. Thank you so much. Listen, I just got a text from the producers. They'd like to change it from hamburger buns with sesames to a completely different object. Uh, better product placement. So what's an object that we're going to... Instead of the hamburger buns with se with sesames, he got what? Siri. He got a Siri. So uh, if you guys can work that in. By the way, you're doing great. It's fabulous acting. Um they, instead of getting that, they got a Siri. Ready? And action. Siri, how did you get a Siri in here? Don't, uh, does she work? I don't think she works. Well, we, we better we better test her out. Maybe maybe she can connect with the drone, and we could get a drone delivery out to the boat. Oh, I like how you think. I like how you think. Siri? What the hell do you say to Siri? Siri? Get a drone. Cut, cut. Thank you so much. This is great. I love the way you incorporate that. Fabulous. Uh, but I got a message from the producers, and they would like Mark to have a, a very specific occupation that he's a little obsessed with. What is that occupation? Optometrist. Uh, you're an optometrist. If you can work that in, the optometrist union would really, would really appreciate it. If you're ready, lights, camera, and action. Not sure, Jordan. Not sure. Maybe shake it, shake it, sh shake her a little bit more. Hmm. Maybe there's a way that we can improve her vision. Ah. How you were using binoculars earlier? Why don't we put her put the binoculars up here? Okay, I think that's a great idea. All right. All right. <gasps> All right, Siri, bring us in a drone. Cut. Fabulous. So good. This is such a good movie. The producers feel that it could use a little bit more emotion. So, Steve, uh, when you start using the binoculars to call the drone, it summons up an emotion. What is that? Nostalgia. Nostalgia. We really want you to, you know, give us a little nostalgia. Thanks so much. And action. You know, Jordan, 
these days, all these motors and electronic stuff, they just, it just doesn't pack it anymore, you know? Sailing used to be sailing. Used to be. Now it's all dominated by technology. Oh, I tell you. I tell you. I wish I wish I could get some technology, not LASIK, not LASIK, but I want it even better. I want to be able to see like the seagulls oh, one yeah. of these days. I tell you, that would be great. We should look that up when we get back to land. Well, it's we can do it right now. We got, we, we got Siri. But fabulous. You do. Keep that in mind. You have Siri. It's going really well. The... um. Here's the thing. The producers have asked that we uh, change some things so that it, it gets it has more of an international feel to it so we can sell it overseas. Uh, can I please have a new accent for Mark? One of the European accent, accents. Russian. Uh, Russian, if you will. Could you please be Russian? And another one for Steve. This is where we want to sell it is, is in Europe. So Italian. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> say Italian at the same time. Uh, so a Russian and an Italian are in a boat in the middle. Anyway, I'm not going to write it for you. Uh, you guys ready? And action. So I'm telling you, Jordan, we have we have to. We, we, you were you're saying that, that, that we can have uh, the eyes are just like the seagulls. Duh. I would like it to do this. This is a good thing. What do I have to do in order to do this? This. <clears throat> Siri. Send us a seagull family. Cut. Fabulous. Fabulous. Uh, the uh, producers have asked that, that uh, Mark suddenly develops a phobia. What is that phobia? Fear of foreign accents. A, uh, a fear of foreign accents. Very interesting. And that Steve develops a fabulous obsession, something that he loves so much that he, he just can't get it off his mind. Foreign accents. <laughs> 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 or in accents, obviously. Yes, that is correct. Uh, Mark, you're terrified of foreign accents. Steve, you are obsessed and love foreign accents. I, I think it's going along swimmingly, don't you? And action. So Jordan, I, 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 I yeah, yes. So, so, so the city, she, she will be, she will be bringing in the, 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 uh, the seagulls. Then, yes. Yeah. Yes, but uh, please. B uh, please uh, speak s uh, sl slower and more quiet. I it hur it hurts it, it hurts in my in my brain. Well, I am so sorry. I cannot do that. I'm Italian. Okay. Italians speak with their hands. They speak with their hands. They speak with their legs. They talk very very loud. They talk very very fast. It is it is it is who I am. Okay, <laughs> okay, I. I I, I try, I try, I try to get through. Uh, Siri, Siri, can we have a buns of burger f a dozen of? Cut, cut, fabulous, by the way. Fabulous. The producers have told us that they have one more change that they want to make. They want to put some more money into this movie and turn it into a musical. Now, the closing number is when the buns finally arrive and you're going to sing about burger buns. Um, but producers, what style of music would you like to hear them sing? Reggae. I'm sorry, what, uh, Beth Ann, what did you say? I said reggae. The reggae? What did you say, JL? Flamenco. Wow. Flamenco. I'm, uh, uh, my apologies, uh, Beth Ann, but I am going to go with flamenco because I don't know what it is really in the top of my head. So I'd love to hear it. Flamenco, I hope I'm saying it right. Uh, when the burgers, uh, when the burger buns arrive, the big closing number, if you will, and action. <laughs> the buns, the buns are here. 
The bugs are here. They come by city, by drone. I see the buns are arriving. They are beautiful. Sesame seeds. Yum, 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 yum. That's a wrap. Thanks, folks. Well, that'll be out in all the festivals later this season. And we'll be at a bunch of festivals later this season because it's Friday night. It's live. It's improv from New York City. Thank you for coming. Thank you for watching. There's more improv coming at you, so you just hang right in there.